So here's the idea. We drop a movie quote into the show and see if anybody catches on. Hmm. This is HMS Today, and I am Nate Schneider, and you are the reason we do what we do. So welcome. This week we had an explosion of production, so we'll fit in what we can and post the rest on our website. Now, we got a lot of great clubs in our school, so let's take a look at the Diversity Club. We are hoping to find students who are willing to share out something that makes their cultures or backgrounds unique. For instance, the Chinese New Year will be celebrated in February, and we are currently looking for students to celebrate who celebrate the New Year and would be willing to share out a bit about the holiday with the rest of the HMS student body. If you are interested in sharing out any aspect of your culture with the middle school community, please go to your grade level Google Classroom and complete our survey. And for those of you with a tight schedule, you'll be happy to know that we have an open door policy and you can participate when it is convenient for you. There is so much opportunity here. And by the way, we have a playlist on our website with videos from lots of more clubs so you can see what you're missing. If your club does have a video, who are you going to call? And while we're waiting, let's welcome Mr. Keller with a minute with the principal. Good morning, HMS. It's nice to be with you once again here on HMS TV now that we're back into the swing of things for 2018. I hope your year is off to a great start. Right before the winter break, you may have seen me walking into your classrooms with several adults. As you may or may not know, our superintendent, Dr. Kathy McLeod, is retiring at the end of the year. Part of the interview process to determine our next superintendent was to visit each school and spend time walking through the building. At the conclusion of that process, Dr. Carol Cavanaugh, our current assistant superintendent, was named to replace Dr. McLeod at the end of the school year. I'm pleased to inform you that HMS TV will have an opportunity to interview Dr. McLeod in an upcoming segment where she'll talk about her time here in Hopkinton and her retirement plans. We'll also have a chance in the future to hear from Dr. Cavanaugh. In other news, in case you haven't heard, our spring musical has been named and is taking shape. Annie will be performed in our auditorium on April 27th and 28th. We're looking forward to seeing the show then and perhaps some sneak peeks. Finally, as we approach the long weekend, I'd like to remind us all of the reason for Monday as a holiday. It is, as you hopefully know, Martin Luther King Jr. Day. Here at HMS, there will be many activities taking place. Eighth grader Marina Youssef will be in Boston representing Hopkinton at Project 351. We'll hear more from Marina in her day in the future as well. As we enjoy this day off on Monday, please keep in mind the words of Dr. King. Life's most persistent and urgent question is, what are you doing for others? Thank you, Mr. Keller. Now let's check in with Fun Fact Friday. Carnival! What? Carnival! Okay, roll the winter carnival promo. We are here from Student Council to invite all sixth graders to a special winter event. The sixth grade winter carnival will be held next Friday night in the Brown Gym from 6.30 to 8.30. The cost to get in is a $5 donation, which includes free popcorn. We'll have a DJ, movie, carnival games, candy, and the chance to win free prizes. Permission slips are available in the guidance office and on the, on the school website and are due by Wednesday. See Ms. McDonough in room 252 with any questions. See you there! Sixth graders are lucky graders. Wait, that was stupid. Forget I said that. Back to Fun Fact Friday! Good morning and welcome to another edition of Fun Fact Friday. Did you know that there are only four words in the English language that end with D-O-U-S? That's right. And they are hazardous, horrendous, stupendous, and tremendous. Listen, if you can be anything in the world, be kind. Make it a great day and have a wonderful weekend. Cool. Thanks, Mr. Rockwood. Coming up is not question of the day. No room for it in today's show. Sorry. Go check it out on our website where we're asking what's the worst advice you've been given. While you're there, look for last week's Economics Club video because the first meeting is next week. And now it's time for the birthday scroll. Happy birthday, everyone. Now it's time to get real. Was last week's Have You Seen This really that hard? Nobody got it. All right, forget about that. We'll do something different, like a pop quiz. Ew! What? Hey, it can be fun. I like pop quizzes. Visit our site and take the pop quiz, and we'll pick a random winner from the correct answers or our highest score. And you can win this water bottle filled with candy. But since we love Have You Seen This, we got one just for the teachers and staff. 
If you're a teacher or staff person, have you seen this? Take a selfie at this location or tell us where it is and you may win a cool new water bottle. This, that's it for today. So visit hkm.tv slash hmstv and send us all your suggestions, comments, and constructive criticism to hmstv at hillers.org. Until next week, be nice. Why are you wearing a coat? Is it cold in here or something? No, I just am. Why? I, Because I want to. Why? Wait, you guys really want to know? Yeah. Okay, fine. What the <laughs> We have a playlist of websites with... Oh, oh. <laughs> Whoops. Look at last week's Economos Club's video. Economics. What did I say? Wait, 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 what did I say? Okay, let's try this again. Next week's economics club. Last week, <laughs> why is this? Oh, oh wait, that does.